time for some Smash or Pass Spooky Edition. I've had this idea in my brain since Markiplier did it with Pokemon. Smash. I mean, I could have done Pokemon, but I've already admitted that I would let Marchoke <laughs> choke me. So I've selected some classic Halloween monsters and some more obscure demons, and <laughs> I'm gonna tell you if I would smash or pass. So I know, I'm not a fan of the word smash. It reminds me of straight boys at school. Well, I'm gonna smash that. But we're gonna assume these monsters have agreed to give me a bit of their monster. Let's go. Frankenstein, he's got a nice body. Those bolts might give you something to hold on to. <laughs> No! Phil, remember what channel you're on. But I feel like he would stink, as he's technically a dead body. And there's only so much stench Nivea body spray for men is gonna cover up, so I'm gonna go pass. Oh. Okay, I just made up a new rule. If I pass, I'm gonna Google sexy version of the monster and then see if I would smash sexy Frankenstein. Oh, hello! <laughs> okay, that's changed everything. I don't know if it's the tattoos <laughs> or the glowing green eye. But I'm gonna put a peg on my nose and smash. Dracula! Hi! Yes! Suck my blood! I mean, Dracula, vampires, they're always sexy. That's the point. They wanna suck your blood. <laughs> I think I'd let him have a little nibble. Just out of curiosity, what is sexy Dracula? <laughs> oh god. Put some pants on, dude. I think I'm gonna stick with the traditional. I mean, he'd take me back to his castle. He'd take me back to a smelly bedroom. So, smash, pass. A mummy. Pass. Oh. They're rotten inside. You don't want to be kissing them and then their lips come off in your mouth. I'd also get tangled by the bandages, probably choke myself. Unless we're talking about the mummy from the movie, because he was a gay awakening for me, seriously. Oh my god, there's actual fan edits <laughs> of Imhotep. Smash. What is a sexy male mummy? Oh! <laughs> uh, let's just say there's not many bandages on that, <laughs> on that one. Wow. Smash. A ghost. No, I mean... No. <laughs> Sometimes if I walk over someone's grave, I will get a tingle in my nips. You get a bit of a, ooh, that's quite nice. But you don't know who the ghost is. Who, what, that, the, I mean, it could have been Sexy Blake from work that got crushed by a steamroller. If so, steamroll me up. But also maybe it's Sticky Tom from Apartment 7. You don't know. You don't know who the ghost is. Pass. Oh. But what is a sexy ghost? <laughs> Why is that the first result for Sexy Ghost? What died and made that? I don't know. But it's a pass. Oh. Zombie! Again, they're rotting. I don't want your ear coming off in my mouth while I give it a sensual nibble. <laughs> so, pass. 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 What about a sexy zombie? Ooh! The zombussy is out! I mean, this is a costume. Let's imagine it's real. He is actively bleeding. He would be rancid. He'd be making out. He'd be trying to eat my brain. I... No. Pass. Even though... He got an ass. A werewolf. I mean, it's literally a dog. I've <laughs> I'm not going there. But on the other 28 days of the year, yeah, it depends if you're a hot guy. If I search sexy werewolf, are we gonna get Jacob? Oh, it's Teen Wolf Man. We can smash. Is he gay? Didn't they do a bit of gay in Teen Wolf in the end? I mean, this TV show knew what they were doing when they chained him to a post. This is Halloween. That I, I, everyone's had a weird crush on Grax. What? I'm just thinking about the logistics. He's literally a skeleton. <laughs> so, I think we'd figure it out. I feel like he'd have some cold bony bones, if you know what I'm saying. Satan. No one really knows what he looks like. So let's have a look at a few. Pass, I feel like this one would snap me in half. Again, I'm gonna pass. This one will appeal to furries. He's got <laughs> literally covered in fur. I like the wings. He could take me on a date and fly me around the underworld. Too fluffy and he's got hooves. It's giving me horse prince vibes. Oh my God, the Satan behind door number three is a uh, censored smash. Oh, oh no, stop it. Stop, no. A witch. This one was pretty mean. I don't think she'd even want to go near me. Also, I'd be nervous of dropping a drink on her and then she'd melt. What about a sexy man witch? Man witch? A man witch. It's the Babadook. <laughs> Do you know, I did not picture that in my head when I was searching man witch, but I'll take it. Smash. Slender man. No, not under any circumstances. I don't care what you want to do with those tentacles. You are too creepy. You have no face. Still curious what's beneath the suit, but it's a pass. What is sexy Slender man? <laughs> Just Slender man with boobs. She's like, I'm still scary, but the boobs. Smash. Now I could stop this here, but my favorite TV show, Buffy, is full of demons. You don't have to have seen it. I'm just gonna do a speed round. Smash. <laughs> my ship was like, hmm. Pass. Oh. 
Is it weird that I'd rather smash that than this? Uh, yeah, uh, pass. Oh. Angel, it's a smash. When Angel smashes and has that one moment of true happiness, he loses his soul and then would probably rip my neck out. I think it'd be worth it. Oh, no! Absolutely not. He paralyzes you and likes to eat skin. I almost said smash, oh my god. Freudian slip. That is a pass. Oh. Spike. Another gay awakening. Fellow British person, he's an insta smash. I mean, people think Buffy's a kid's show. It did get pretty sexy in the later season. The Master, kind of a gay icon. Dresses a little bit like Dan, but, <laughs> but his mouth looks really sore and diseased, so it's a pass. Uh. Moloch the Corrupter, he's a robot demon. I feel like inevitably in the next 50 years, a lot of people are gonna be having some robot loving, so why not test it out? I think it's Smash. Also, I could go on the internet on his belly afterwards. Oh no! <laughs> pass! Ooh, yeah. Ben. Smash. He shares his body with an ultra powerful woman god and they switch at random. It might create a bit of a sexually confusing situation if they switch while we're at it, but I'm gonna go smash. Balthazar. I mean, I'd happily take a bath with him. He looks very comfy, but he does turn people to dust when he touches them. So that's a pass. Smash. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's the sexy science teacher. I'm gonna pass. Oh. She goes after virgin males, turns into a praying mantis, and chops off their heads. So, mm, mm, oh, we're oh. gonna pass. <laughs> I feel like Buffy ran out of budget on this episode because this one's just called <laughs> Fire Demon. Obviously, Smash. He'd have to keep his hands behind his back, though. He's quite muscular. I'm gonna. S smash. That is literally a snake. Ooh, Dad. Yes, this is Dracula in Buffy. Probably the hottest depiction of Dracula. I've seen on screen. Smash. Okay, that is a Buffy werewolf, but this is what he looks like when he's not a werewolf. I did have a big crush on Oz in his college years, so smash and- <laughs> That's enough. That is absolutely enough. Smash. Oh, I can't get it to close, go away. No, we'll look at him again, there we go. I feel like I just learned some things about myself that I shouldn't have revealed to the internet, but thank, <laughs> thank you for joining me on this adventure. Turns out getting your wisdom teeth removed is the true Halloween horror. Look at me, I look like a freaking chipmunk. That was two weeks ago. Since then I developed Lockjaw, which is about as fun as it sounds. Couldn't even get a piece of toast in there let alone a banana. If I truly wanted to horrify you, I would just make a 20 minute video about what happened to me in that chair. Teeth dust was blowing into my eyes. So give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this. Merry Halloween to all those who celebrate. Go check out my last video where Dan reveals that he is leaving me. Subscribe, have a good day, have a good life. Ding the bell, please ding it. Apparently it's important. And I will see you very soon. Goodbye. Ah! <gasps> <gasps>